all the energy in the world from Stepanovic. Again, they missed the and one, but he gets the offensive rebound, flips it back. Open spot for the three. Eddie locked, loaded, and hitting the target is Klujar time and time again. Aggressive play, but nothing to show for it again. And they want the continuation on the basket as Quinn Ellis flips it up and it's a defense dominated second. Static three point shot doesn't go. Now Trento trying to offer the same energy down the floor. Quinn Ellis in the control tower says to Derek Cup Jr., You are cleared for takeoff. A series of lead changes at the start of the third quarter. Guzman trying to inflict another. Carol Guzman up to 14 points. Stepanovic, no luck, and how about the throwdown from Mokoka? Stevens looking back out, shot clock winding down again, three seconds to shoot, Ellis can't work his magic this time. Transition opportunity, bounce pass, Stepanovic uses the window to avoid the shot block attempt from Stevens. Richard, five points, four assists, four rebounds so far for him. Guzman. Attacking and somehow scoring, showing his muscle. Bryce Jones back in, having sat for much of the third quarter. Now a chance for a double-digit lead for the host again. Bryce Jones, three-point shot, high arcing, pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. Richard. Kurtzay. Back to the captain, three-point shot, bang! Only three and a half minutes ago. Now it's 17. Strong attack to the rack, right back from Kamar Baldwin. Okay. It's only gone down as a two, toes on the line. That one's certainly a three for Beligo. Figures blocked off though the pass, and a turnover. This is off the back of the timeout. Just take time. Three-point shot is good, Kamar Baldwin. It's a four-point game. Just the third visiting team to win here all season. Hubbard to Grajulis, back out. Ellis, his moment, knocks it down, and Trento within a whisper. There's an eight-second differential. Jones trapped, gets free, finds the pass, and leaves Mayoris with a simple task to stick it in. A very credible performance, but it's Cluj Napoca who celebrate a fourth straight win and a seventh win in nine on home court to tie level in wins at the top of the Group B standings. A real team performance with five scorers in double figures.